Hey you doing? Welcome back to the Heavy Design Co workshop. That's pretty much the extent of my guitar playing, but this little baby is gonna feature pretty heavily in this build. So this week's build is my entry into Dana Designs, Dana Maids, Rubbish Wood Builds 2020. Rubbish Wood 2020 build. My wife is a avid guitarist. She loves playing the guitar. Just bought herself this beautiful little Taylor GS Mini. It's a cool little beast. Um, sounds amazing. I love it. But you know what? Guitars have one problem. They don't stand up on their own. It just keeps falling. So what I'm going to do, she doesn't know about it, is I'm actually going to build her a stand for it so that she can keep it on display and keep it out in the open so everyone can see how awesome it looks. Let's get into it. I've got this great pattern that I actually got from uh, Crafted Workshop. It's on available as a free plan on his website. If you're not following him on YouTube, jump over, have a look at his channel as well. Does some awesome stuff. Um, that's Crafted Workshop. Um, all credit for the plan and, this, and the template there. I'm gonna run off that. My rubbish wood for this build, probably some pretty fancy looking rubbish wood, but this is actually massive offcuts from a round dining table I made last year. It's all recycled black butt. And I'm gonna try, I've got two of these. I'm gonna try and squeeze out the two pieces that I need. Might need to get creative and cut and re-glue some pieces, but let's get into it. Let's see if we can make it happen and get it made. There it is. The general shape is cut out. You can see the two of them. They're pretty much done. What I'm gonna do now is actually join the two of them together so that I can try and finish them off. I'll pull out the belt sander, the orbital sander, uh, maybe even a few hand files and stuff just to clean them up even so that they're, you know, mirror image essentially. Um, there's a little bit of twisting and bowing in them which I'm not too concerned about because it's because of what it is, it's not gonna affect the build at all. What it is gonna affect though is me trying to clamp them together. So what I'm gonna do is utilize some of these little old screw holes and stuff that are in them as recycled timber. Um, I'm gonna drive a couple of little screws through just to bring them together and that'll hold them while I clean them up. So let's jump into it, get it done. Well done, I've unscrewed them, but they are mirror image of each other. I've actually come back through, got a little 
there's really no point to it, just a bit decorative, a little cut out in the corner there, um, just to give it a little bit of nicer shape. Um, I've got my chamfer bit queued up in the router, it lives there all the time. I'm going to come through, put a chamfer edge on all these, and then we'll sand it up ready for finish. Okay, there we go. We're all cleaned up, all sanded up, edge profiles on, down to shape. Now it's ready to put some finish on. There's a couple of bits I'll do after I put the finish on, um, but one, I need to actually go and get the parts. Two, I just want to get it finished first and I prefer to put finish on first. So first bit is I need a hinge that'll go inside so that when it sits, it'll sit like this with a hinge in the middle. So I need to grab that hinge yet. And a little bit of cord or leather or whatever I want to use just to stop it spreading too far. Well, let's get the finish on it. I've got myself, I've still got a couple of samples of this hard wax uh, oil from Evolution, from Whittle Waxes. Um, I've had it for a long time. Um, I really need to use it up. So I'm gonna use it on this. So let's get into it. There you have it ladies and gentlemen, my guitar playing is still no better, but here it is, my Rubbish Builds 2021 entry, sweet ass little guitar stand for this beautiful little Taylor GS Mini, look at that, finally, it's not stuck in its case anymore, it can stand out. Take the place, pride of joy. And for a bit of old recycled black butt that was due for the rubbish bin, it came out pretty good, if I must say so myself. Pretty straightforward build. I've put some felt pads on here just to help not scuff up the guitar. Um, and I just used a simple bit of string across the bottom to help spread it. I didn't want anything too layerish or anything like that. Um, and then you saw the antique hinge that went into the middle. Folds up nice, simple, compact little stand. Open it out. Done. Till next time, stay safe, keep building, and if you're a guitarist, rock on. <laughs>